Hey guys, I'm Justin Spear, and today we're going to be looking at the Filson Tin Cloth Lined Cruiser Jacket. So this jacket is in the dark tan color. Uh, this is my favorite color. It comes in another color called Cinder, which is more of a black or dark gray color. But this is, in my opinion, the, the classic color. Um, I just love it. The, the material is um, a duck cloth, um, really tight weave and uh, it makes it water resistant. Uh, right now the weather's a little bit of rain, a little bit of snow, and uh, it's, it's holding up fine. Definitely uh, warm inside. This jacket is really heavy, so um, that's part of what makes it so durable and uh, hesitate to use the word bomb proof, but that's what it feels like. Um, just made for working in the outdoors because of the, the weight of this jacket, I, I probably wouldn't use it uh, for hiking. It'd be a little too heavy for that, but pretty much anything else in the outdoors um, would be perfect for this jacket. So this jacket has four cargo pockets on the outside. Uh, and they're pretty generous. Fit a lot of stuff in here. Um, I like them. This one has a tiny little pocket here. I don't know what you'd put in there. Maybe some buttons or something fun. But uh, this one's cool because it has uh, some slots for pens or a little flashlight or something. I like that. And uh, definitely like the snaps on this. And th the lining makes it quite a bit warmer than the unlined version. So I definitely like the lining. Plus, I don't like having that um, kind of waxy cotton feel um, on the inside. So I'm glad I got the lined version. Now on the back of this jacket, there's a game pocket. It's got a, an opening here and then opening on the other side and it goes all the way through. So you could put a, a duck that you just shot uh, in there or squirrel or whatever. But uh, for me, I'd probably just uh, use it as a map pocket. Um, kind of old school um, when I'm out in the woods or out and about, I like taking a, a hard copy map uh, with me wherever I go. So uh, I'd probably use it for that, but it's nice to have options. The price on this jacket is $425 right now. Uh, when I first started looking at them, they were right around 300 or maybe a little over 300. So they've definitely gone up in price recently, but I totally feel like it's worth it. Um, I really enjoy this so far. And um, one other thing I like is that um, on the sleeves, they use uh, double layering of the uh, duck cloth. So it's a little more durable on the sleeves. So that's great. All in all, it just feels like a total uh, quality uh, jacket. As far as the sizing goes, uh, this particular jacket is a large. And I'm uh, 6'1 and about 200 pounds. So that gives you some reference. But uh, normally with jackets, I'm a 2XL. I like to have jackets a little roomy so I can layer underneath. But um, after reading comments on the website and uh, people's reviews, uh, I made the decision to get a large. And I'm, I'm so glad I did. If I had purchased an extra large uh, or heaven forbid a 2XL, I, I would have been just swimming in it. Um, this one's got the perfect length uh, on the, the sleeves. Um, it, it just fits perfectly and you know I normally wear two or three layers underneath so it's got room for that but um, so I, I would definitely go down a size or two uh, if you're ordering one of these but I think the best thing is to try it on in the store just to get the perfect fit um, it's just sometimes hard to, to find this particular jacket in stock um, like I said, I'd, I'd been waiting about a year to buy one of these and when it finally came in stock, I, I just had to jump on it and order one. But um, if I were you, I'd, I'd look through the comments on uh, the Filson website. Uh, a lot of people list their height and weight and what size jacket they got and then you can kind of judge uh, what size is best for you from, from those comments. But uh, I, I love this jacket so far. I think it's going to be great. Thanks for watching.